Everyone knows the basic rules of capitalization. You always capitalize at the beginning of a sentence, and you capitalize proper nouns, such as the names of people and places, as well as the titles of people, such as Mr., Mrs., Doctor, etc. The more difficult thing is capitalizing titles, so titles of documents, articles, blog posts, email subject lines, and press releases. Now, there are some rules that are set in stone, but there are others that you are able to decide. The most important thing is, of course, to be consistent. So you must capitalize like you would a sentence. Capitalize the first word and other proper nouns that require it, such as the name of a person or place. And this is the only required rule across the board. You should capitalize the first and last word. Many people do this if they don't want to capitalize the entire thing. You can choose to capitalize only nouns. So for example, how to grow your business with QuickBooks. You can also capitalize everything, but this is considered by many to look kind of sloppy and lazy. So the most common method is to capitalize major words. So I'm going to describe a list of some of the major words to capitalize and what not to capitalize. You do want to capitalize nouns, such as business and employee, adjectives like profitable and smart, verbs like expand, monetize, grow, and a commonly misused verb in this case is is. Oftentimes people don't capitalize is, but it is a verb and you should capitalize it. Adverbs like slowly, efficiently, pronouns like he, she, and it, subordinating conjunctions like that, because, as, and there are also a lot of things that you should not capitalize including articles like a, an, and the, coordinating conjunctions, and, but, and or, and short prepositions, generally less than five letters, on, by, under, things of that nature. So for example, you would capitalize how to grow your business with QuickBooks this way. So next we're going to talk about how to capitalize within quotations, so stay tuned.